Okay, so if you want to add games with Demol Shooter into your launch box, um, I'm assuming you're talking about like the ones on Techno Parrot, um, but it really doesn't matter. But uh, for exist this example, I'll use one that's like going on a Techno Parrot. You go to you know import ROM, and uh, we're just going to add the file. And in this case, I'll like I'll add Rambo. So Rambo's in my C directory C, and the actual executable is in disk zero elf Rambo D elf. That's the executable the Techno Parrot uses. Um, next, the platform doesn't you know just for organization. I just put it under Arcade. Next, I say it's for Techno Parrot. I'll tell you why this really doesn't matter in a second. Use files in their current location. Blah 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 and wait for that to import. Now it's probably not gonna know what Rambo D is, but it says one game imported and there it is. So we'll right click on the game now that it's in LaunchBox. And we'll go to edit. And one, I just wanna change the name to actually Rambo. And we search for metadata. And look, Rambo 2008, that's the game, right? So um, over here, under emulation, see we got it using TechnoParrot, uncheck use an emulator. And then up here in launching, the it says, it's when you uncheck use emulator, this switches from ROM path to application path. Um, I don't actually care about running the actual Rambo DL file. I'm gonna browse over, and what I'm gonna do is browse to C, and in this folder, I've got a bunch of batch files, and I'm going to select the batch file, and that's the file that LaunchBox is going to run, and uh, I'm going to hit OK. So now the batch file I just selected is actually this, which looks similar to what we were trying to do with Aliens. It's just a batch file that it goes into the Demol Shooter folder, executes Demol Shooter with the Rambo arguments for the Limburg system, then it goes to my TechnoParrot folder, and it starts TechnoParrot with the profile for my Rambo XML. So this is this last line, that's the command line version of running TechnoParrot. It's TechnoParrot and what game you want it to run. So that uh, XML file should match what you've got in your TechnoParrot uh, user profiles. And this should be one for every game. So the Rambo is, you know, just take the .xml off the end. And that's the profile you're using. So it's Rambo.xml. Oh, okay. I guess you don't take XML off, but Rambo.xml is profile equal Rambo.xml. But yeah, this uh, this lets you run the batch file when you launch the game in LaunchBox, which should initiate Demol Shooter. Um, by the way, if you're adding something here with a batch file and it doesn't understand, like it doesn't load images or anything, it's really easy. If you click Edit, once we've corrected the name and it has a LaunchBox ID, it found it in here. You can go back into media and download media. Now that it's got the correct game um, uh, in the LaunchBox ID, it should be able to query emu movies and get some stuff to download. So we'll just download that. I'm gonna hit OK. And now Rambo has images. So you can see. Um, yeah, so I have batch files set up for all of my games that use Demol Shooter, and I just, again, I uncheck Use Emulator and point it to the batch file instead. And that way, when you launch Rambo, it runs that batch file, which starts TechnoParrot and gets everything going. Cool.